Hello, today I'm going to show you how to make this tag, which is pretty easy. It mostly just uses the stroke layer style. So you can see here, I've already pulled in um, this clip art. I drew this clip art in Illustrator, but you can find lots of great looking clip arts on the internet. Um, I'll leave some links below this tutorial. I'm going to start here by drawing an oval. So I'm going to come over here, get my ellipse tool, make a new layer, and then I'm just going to kind of draw something that looks good. Um, can't see that because it's white. I'm just going to shrink it a little. Okay, that looks pretty good. Um, I'm going to select both layers and using the move tool I'm just going to align it so it's in the center. Okay. I'm going to start by making this pink. So I've just locked this layer. And I'm going to make it pink. Um, it's a little thin, I think, so I'm going to go ahead and add a stroke in the same pink color. Uh, how does that look? looks pretty good. I'll maybe just go a little less. Okay, so now I've already added a stroke and I want to add another stroke. I want to give it another edge. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click here and say rasterize layer style. Um, this is new to CS6 so in a moment I'll show you how to do that if you don't have CS6. Um, I'm going to turn this off for a second and now I want to add another stroke. Um, this time I want to do white. And this time I think I want it to be a little fatter, so maybe I'll try 10. Okay, so that's good. I'm not going to do any more strokes, so I can just leave that as it is. Okay, so I've turned my oval back on. So now I'm going to go ahead, duplicate my oval. Um, first, why don't I bring in my paper here? so we can see what's going. So I've just dragged in a paper, and I'm going to right click, create clipping mask, there. And now I want to, uh, this duplicated layer that's still underneath, I'm going to add a stroke to it as well. And I'm going to use the same pink color. This one I want to be a little bigger. Okay, that looks pretty good. Um, I'm going to duplicate again. And then here on the bottom, I'm going to go back to this white color. This one I want to be pretty big, so let's try 50. That's not big enough. That's a little too big. Oops, too big. All right, that looks pretty good. OK, so now you can see I have all of these layers. Um, if you don't have that rasterize option when you right click, you can just make a new layer and then merge them together. So now it's been the style's been flattened. Merge layers. I don't know if you can see that, but I'm coming down here to the option merge layers. You can also do that up here. Do, do, do. Where is it? Oh, here, merge layers. <laughs> okay. I don't go up there very often, as you can tell. Now, just to finish it up, I'm going to bring in some papers. So here's the pink one. I'm going to clip that there. And then one more paper. And I'm going to clip this one here. So now you can see here's the original. And here's what we've just made. So pretty easy just using the stroke style.